Hey, what's up, guys? 98 Sports Talk here. So I'm doing a uh, ESPN FPI rankings for each SEC school, so be sure to check out the other ones if you are interested. Um, and also stay tuned to the uh, end of the video where I'm going to give ESPN's final rank for Ole Miss, what they say Ole Miss will be at at the end of the season, and their projection uh, on Ole Miss's record. Let's get into the uh, the schedule here, first of all, and the percent chances of winning each game or losing each game, whatever, uh, whichever way you look at it for Ole Miss. First game uh, up for Ole Miss is at home for uh, versus Texas Tech. ESPN gives Ole Miss a 47.8% chance of winning that game. Sounds about fair to me. Next game, so, uh, Southern Illinois, 95% chance to win that one. Next one is at home versus Bama. Uh, ESPN is giving Ole Miss a 14.7% chance to win that one. That's probably about fair. Bama is going to be pretty good this season. Uh, next game is Kent State at 98% chan uh, percent chance to win that one. Then LSU, uh, excuse me, and then on the road versus LSU, 30% uh, chance to win that game. I think that's probably fair. I actually think LSU is underrated this year, especially by ESPN. Next game is at home versus Louisiana Monroe. ESPN gives uh, Ole Miss a 90% chance to win that one. Then at Arkansas, 50% chance to win that one. That may be slightly low. I don't know how, how good Arkansas is going to be this season. Uh, next one is um, at home versus Auburn. 20% chance to win that one. Probably maybe slightly higher, but pretty fair, I think, there. Next one is at home versus South Carolina, given uh, Ole Miss actually a 52% chance to win that game. I think that may be a little bit high. I think South Carolina might be pretty good this year. Next one is on the road at Texas A&M. Uh, only a 24% chance to win that one. I disagree with that one. I think that percentage has got to be a little bit higher. Then at Vanderbilt, a 71% chance to win that one. That one may even be slightly high. Um, I don't know how good Vandy is going to be this year. I don't think they're going to be very good, but I still think 70% chance might be slightly high. Um, and then rounding out the season in the Egg Bowl, Mississippi State, um, Ole Miss has got a 32% chance of winning that game, according to ESPN. And I'd say that's that's maybe slightly low, being that it's a rivalry game. Um, but you guys let me know what you guys think about the, um, you know, those percentages there. Also, uh, you know, like I mentioned at the beginning of the video, let's hit what ESPN thinks. The projected win-loss is going to be for uh, for Ole Miss. It's going to be 6.3 wins and 5.7 losses. So basically ESPN thinks Ole Miss is going to finish at 6-6 six and six on the season with a uh, final ranking of 45. So nowhere near the top 25. Chance of winning out, 0.0% chance. I think that's fair. Don't see uh, Ole Miss winning out ever. Um, chance of winning the conference, 0.1% chance. I, I'd say that's accurate. I can't see Ole Miss in any universe winning the SEC this season. Um, and their strength of schedule is uh, ranked at a 46. But you guys let me know what you think down in the comment section about what ESPN thinks about Ole Miss. And also, if you haven't done so, hit that subscribe button. I'm trying to build up this SEC community. Would love to do more Ole Miss videos. Just need to get some more uh, Ole Miss fans going on this channel. But uh, yeah, so smash that sub button and I'll see you guys in the next video.